Hi guys, today video will be a quick and short video to talk about the setting of the fail safe features for this Dumbbell RC receiver X6YC uh, bracket G. Uh, the G is stand for gyro, so this one comes with the gyro and the X6YC. Uh, this receiver have the fail safe feature for its channel one and channel two, and it also have some uh, other features for the channel 3 and 4 so I'll be showing you uh, how to do the setting for the fail safe function for channel 1 uh, the setting uh, procedure is the same for ch channel 1 and channel 2 so let me plug in this um, uh, servo and also the power okay I turn on the transmitter first and then turn on the receiver so you see when I turn on and I turn off the transmitter it lost the connection with the transmitter but the the servo is still uh, stay in the same positions so if let's say you want to set your servo into certain positions when it lost the signal from the transmitter you can do it on this uh, receiver so how to do it basically is very simple and easy so first when we turn on both the transmitter and the receiver okay there's a buy button here okay buy button let me i think press it this so we can see the light later okay so let's say we want to set the uh, position of the servo place it over here so it's easier for you to see okay so let's say we want to set the position of the servo all the way backward so I will just turn my hand wheel all the way backward and then I press once so you see blinking within 5 seconds press again okay so now it's set so you see I turn off the radio the transmitter you see it will go to the position that I have preset just now so when I turn it on you go back to the neutral positions so this is when you lost the connections of the uh, receiver and the transmitter then it will go to the server uh, the position that you have preset okay so let's see again then how to reset it to the original position it's very simple you just repeat the same position but without uh, turning your hand wheels okay so you see okay I do it now and I show you the light okay give you clearer view press one okay blinking press again okay so now I turn it on I turn it off you see it will stay in the neutral position instead of the earlier one so um, for the throttle is the same so you see throttle if let's say I change it to the second channel okay let me show you I turn it on turn it on okay so I uh, press my tri uh, trigger all the way backward okay then I set it okay it's kind of difficult to do it in one hand okay so I press one time press again it's a short press huh? not long press okay so See, now I already set the positions that I want. I turn off my transmitter. See, and then I turn it on again. So this is basically to set your server position that you want if in case you lost the connection with your transmitter. It's a fail safe feature. So I reset to the factory position. Press one. Okay, blinking. Press again okay so now I turn off it doesn't move okay now I'm going to talk about the feature for the channel 
3 and 4. <coughs> Excuse me. So channel 3. Okay, this is the... Small speaker. Okay, so... I'm not sure whether you can hear it or not. Okay, hope you can hear it. Okay, when I turn it on. Okay, if I switch it to channel 4. Okay, turn it back on again. Okay, channel 4. I think yeah. channel four positions. Okay, let's do it again. Okay. Then push all the way forward. Uh, because this is not the buzzer, I don't have it with me, so it's supposed to have a long uh, sound uh, instead of uh, one clicking sound if you push all the way forward. Okay, now I think I show you with the other one, the soy not. Okay, um, plug it into channel 4. Okay. so you can control this as well okay turn it on wait let me see I think I lost the power okay so see I push it to the middle position huh? The way forward is pushing forward then I you can't do this on the other receiver model okay so same thing if you connect this to the channel 3 because this is a 12 volt uh, it, it needs power to run this, so mine is only 2S, so the power is a little bit weak. So let's turn on. Okay, show you again. Okay, off. Uh, there's a slight delay. Okay, so basically this is the features of this uh, receiver. Uh, you can use it to control like um, other things okay many other things uh, you can't do it on the earlier version of the receiver or this uh, light version you can't do it on the channel 3 4 or the failsafe for channel 1 and 2 only this model so show you again remember okay so thank you for watching thank you very much